Hi, my name is Sumbul and welcome to my channel. So today I'm reviewing the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette because I've been using it for a few months now. So I'm just telling my thoughts whether it's a thumbs up or a thumbs down product. So without any further delay, let's jump into the video. So first I'll talk about the packaging. It's really beautiful and sleek and holds three shades of highlighter in it. And then there is this elongated small mirror that comes with a compact. But I would say that the material with which this palette is made scratches extremely easily and is a big fingerprint magnet. So that's the only downside I can think as far as the packaging goes. Now let's talk about the product inside. So as I already mentioned, there are three different highlighter shades inside. And the names are Dim Light, Incandescent Light and Radiant Light. The ones I most often use are these two. That is Dim Light and Incandescent Light. I think they complement my skin tone the most, so I keep on reaching for them again and again. The third one, that is the Radiant Light, rarely gets used because I like the other two better. So the formulation of these highlighters is excellent in my opinion. The powder is very smooth and easy to apply and it doesn't contain any chunky glitter particles that you may see in some of even the big brand makeup. So I'm not really a big fan of the chunky in your face type of highlighter. I much rather prefer this one that produces a very subtle effect and can be used, you know, on a daily basis. And even if you want to build on the intensity, you can very easily do that by using the regular methods like, you know, uh, spraying some setting spray on your sponge and then just dabbing it in the highlighter and then pressing it on your cheeks. So if you repeat this procedure a couple of times, you can produce a more striking result. But as far as I'm concerned, I like the everyday very subtle effect, so I just uh, use a regular brush and just apply a little bit of highlighter on my cheeks and then I'm ready. So although this is an expensive kit, but I do think that you get a decent amount of product considering how little you have to use. Especially if you're using it like me, for a very subtle effect, it will last you a long long time. In fact, I think that if you're using it like me, there's a greater chance of the kit getting expired than you finishing the whole product up. So overall, considering the value for money and the product itself, it's a thumbs up from me. So this brings us to the end of this review. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share this video. And until next time, stay beautiful.